So guys, for the first step, you're gonna head over to search and type in registry editor. Click on it and then click on yes. And now this will come up. And then once you're on this, you can follow everything that I'm gonna be doing up here. So first you're gonna expand HK local machine. Now you're gonna expand software. Now you're gonna expand policies. And now you're gonna expand Microsoft. Now you're gonna find Windows Defender. I wanna make this a bit bigger. We're now gonna find Windows Defender. We're gonna scroll down and then click on Windows Defender. We are now gonna expand Windows Defender. And then once you expand Windows Defender, you should be having something called App Control. You wanna click on it. If you do not have App Control, then you wanna create it. So we're gonna right click on Windows Defender and then click on New and then click on Key. You wanna call this App Control. Spell it with the same capitals and lowercase as I did and then click on Enter. You now wanna click on App Control. Make sure that you're now in the App Control folder. Again, you can follow everything that I did up here. And then once you're in the app control folder, you now want to right click on the white space and then click on new and then click on the word to bit value. We're going to call this enable app control. Spell it with the same capitals and lowercase as I did with the same spelling and then click on enter. And then once we have enable app control, we're now going to double click on it. Now make sure that in this box right here, you have the number zero. Make sure that in the validator box, you have the number zero and then click on OK. It's most likely already going to be on zero by default anyway. And now for the last step, you just want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.